In a small village nestled in the mountains, there lived a woman named May. May had grown up in a culture that prized perfection and beauty above all else. From a young age, she had been taught that anything less than perfect was unworthy of attention or admiration. As a result, May had spent most of her life striving for perfection. She spent hours each day applying makeup and arranging her hair, and she obsessed over every detail of her appearance. She avoided anything that might mar her perfect image, from muddy paths to uneven surfaces. But despite all her efforts, May was never quite satisfied with her appearance. She always felt that she fell short of the ideal of beauty that had been instilled in her from a young age. She was constantly comparing herself to others and finding herself lacking. One day, May was walking through the village when she saw a young girl painting a picture. The girl was not concerned with perfection or beauty, she was simply creating. May watched in amazement as the girl worked, her brush strokes fluid and free. As May watched, she began to realize that the imperfections in the girl's painting were what made it beautiful. The brush strokes that were not quite straight and the colors that were not quite perfect gave the painting a depth and character that perfection could never achieve. It was a revelation for May. She began to see the world through a different lens, one that valued imperfection and uniqueness over conformity and sameness. She started to experiment with her own appearance, trying new hairstyles and makeup looks that were not perfectly polished but had a certain raw beauty to them. As she began to embrace imperfection in her appearance, May also started to see the beauty in imperfection in other areas of her life. She started to appreciate the quirky personalities of her friends and family members, the crooked paths that wound through the mountains, and the imperfect but delicious meals that were served at village gatherings. Through her journey of self-discovery, May learned that perfection was not the key to happiness and fulfillment. Instead, it was the imperfections in life that made it beautiful and worth living. She found a sense of freedom and joy in embracing imperfection and celebrating the unique qualities that made her and others special. May's journey serves as a reminder to all of us to embrace imperfection in ourselves and others. It teaches us that true beauty comes not from perfection, but from the unique qualities that make each of us special. It encourages us to let go of the need to conform to society's ideals of beauty and instead to celebrate the imperfections that make us who we are. In conclusion, the story of the woman who learned to find beauty in imperfection is a powerful reminder of the value of embracing our imperfections and celebrating the unique qualities that make us special. It teaches us that true beauty comes not from perfection, but from the imperfect and unique qualities that make us who we are. It encourages us to let go of the need to conform to societal ideals and instead embrace the beauty of our individuality.